There's a reason All the Light We Cannot See was an international bestseller and Pulitzer Prize winning novel. It's such a rich tapestry of characters and events, and as soon as I read it, I loved it. The novel is really a remarkable piece of work. It's stayed with me, uh, and I'm sure will stay with me. The story of All the Light We Cannot See focuses on Marie and Werner. And their two stories juxtaposed over the course of World War II. The story of war affects and changes the trajectories of the lives of these two curious people who just want to learn things, and the war prevents them from doing so. It's a story about love and survival and triumph over evil. You have Marie Lore, a blind young woman. The question was always, well, how do you represent a disability on screen in a way that feels authentic and equitable to people with that experience? The answer, of course, find someone who was actually blind or low vision. And we found Aria Mia Liberti. Marie's experience of blindness is not a catalyst for the story necessarily. It is her experience as a blind girl navigating love and loss in a time of war. Aria has been a revelation. She never done anything like this, and it's really beautiful to see. It's remarkable. Aria is someone who understands this character in her soul. She's never auditioned, she's never thought about being an actress, and she got the part. To have Marie played by someone who understands what it is like to walk that road. For the young Marie, I found Nell. Aria and Nell stepped up and deliver on that beautifully. I'm gonna keep Marie in my heart. Werner, as this pure soul, being indoctrinated into evil to which he doesn't subscribe. And Lewis just had this innate understanding of Werner. What he most connects with beautiful things and the truth. This show provides a huge amount of intimacy and epicness. Showing those two different types of people living through war and turmoil is so important and I think so many of us will connect with their stories. I think the chance to work with really committed and intelligent and passionate people, I think, is the greatest privilege. I approach the crafting of this series like a four-hour film. It's really moving to see people really putting their hearts and souls and time into something like this. And to see it come to life, it's really special. This material is precious and it's unique. If you follow that, then what you're gonna make is precious and unique in the spirit of that. This massive part in this epic series, it's probably one of the best gifts I've ever been given. This story is both timeless and timely, unabashedly human and emotional. It captured a certain epic scale that we've been truly privileged to bring to life.